I want to make this not only personal, but the end of the conversation. Um, this is not discrediting the greatest of all times before of their own era and their own generations. Okay. Um, but this is why LeBron fucking James is the greatest of all time. Not because he did or did not win 10 or six rings. Not because he did or did not switch teams. I don't even really, really, really feel that means a motherfucking thing. Because overall, when LeBron needed to buzz motherfucking bubbles, he had us. All right? Being drafted in 2003, all right. Only reason is the only reason this feels so far more personal because I haven't even realized LeBron was my favorite player. Maybe because I'm from Cleveland and my first love from Akron. Or maybe I moved to Akron and he used to play in Cleveland. I don't know, but this close to home. Even with the shit with Delonte West and y'all tore my nigga down with that shit. Or well, at least tried to. LeBron, if you want to say fuck the Cavs, the Heats, the Lakers, nigga, fuck the Nuggets. You can really go just get some dipping sauce on your own time. Barbecue sauce, sweet and sour, because on your end is really sweet, even though the defeat is sour. LeBron, to you and yours, and I only speak family. You know what I'm saying? Father and mother, I love you. That's you and yours in your inner circle. That's you and your three. Your wife, as you see. LeBron, you can just leave. You, I mean, I don't even, sometimes I be watching you, bro. I had to show Shorty, like, look how this nigga play. He play like he early 20s. LeBron, what, you 38, 39 type shit? I know it's before 40. I'm 30. I just turned 30. Ending the last year, so I'm probably six months in. Seven. Whatever, how many months in. It doesn't matter. This is about LeBron. This ain't about no dick ride. You mentioned, you know that. I'm not mentioning no rings. LeBron. Lakers lost, but LeBron is still the greatest. LeBron, at this point, you will be the only player to play with his son in the league. And you could do that as long as you want to, as long as you stay healthy. So you could drop out, and I bet motherfuckers would want to join your your team. You could call that motherfucker your middle name. You probably can't see that. Let me, let me, let me. call the team this. You probably can't see it. That's your middle name, nigga. You could just call the team. Ramon, for real, nigga. You got you and Bronny. Bryce Beater soon. You know what I'm saying? My nigga plays all positions. I ain't talking about Bryce and Bronny. I mean, they, 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 you talk about your daddy. LeBron, I mean, hungry. Y'all want to keep talking about who to go. He, LeBron getting over all trials. Comment all the records that LeBron broke. How many points, how many assists, how many steals. Y'all gonna be like, oh, uh, the rings. If LeBron's son comes to the league and he did it, let's just say he did it with three, four times with his son straight, all three back to back to back. That sound like a, a Drake soundtrack, nigga. Y'all wanna keep calling him not the GOAT because y'all only wanna use that or use those letters as only saying the greatest of all time. I, I watched this man get over a lot of trials or get over a lot of tribulations. I already mentioned the Delonte West things, the transition and everything with the fucking heats and everything else he going through with the first few years with the Lakers and the things with the Cavaliers, bro. This nigga was what, 16? <laughs> Fuck you mean. This is why LeBron is the goal because he's gifted obviously 
and talented. Give credit where credit is motherfucking due. I mean, I'm so hopeful of seeing Bronny motherfucking not even just come to the league because I know how to look what the shit doing with little John Morant. You know what I'm saying? So he got a lot of uh, studying he has to do it with the father that he has. I'm pretty sure he will achieve. So like I say, LB, bro. I mean, this may be a Lakers loss, but it's really sweet on your end. It ain't really that sour, bro. You got Bryce coming behind. Like, this ain't about no money, nigga. This ain't about no rings, nigga. You could, you really can buy a fucking ring. If you really want to do it like that, be the first person to fucking um, make a ring with all his teams on it. They make another ring with all his records broken on it. Like a broken record ring. NBA broken record ring. They can't patent that. I mean, unless they're trying to steal my idea. And I meant that only to be for LeBron motherfucking James. LeBron Raymond James. If you want to keep it like that. I'm not using it for myself, nigga, but this is for you. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling ball it up. Look at LeBron, you see what I'm doing? Ball it up, nigga. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Fuck that shit, nigga. So what? I know it hurt, man. Everybody don't like to lose, but LeBron, the way God made you, I'm going to tell you one thing and one thing for sure. You have nothing to worry about. You are you winning. You winning. If anything, we're down there in North Carolina. Shit. Tell me about Bronny. Because I'm really excited about that shit too, bro. <laughs> bro, I used to watch Bryce too. Look, this nigga just skyrocketed to the... I swear to God, bro. This little nigga, just little, this little nigga just skyrocketed to the skies. You know what I'm saying? Uh, don't condone this, man. I do my own thing. I'm Bob Marley. One love and all this. And all this love, you know what I'm saying? Seek wisdom and love. Man, I, I, I really, I, I, I really enjoy the game of basketball when there's such a passionate person. Because for real, for real, for real. Only reason motherfucking Michael Jordan didn't do it. LeBron, look, Michael Jordan had a gambling to get the addiction. Only reason he invested, I, 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 I'm not comparing the prisons that he bought or invested in. That nigga had a gambling addiction. We got shit to pay off, cuz. You know what I'm saying? We talk about back in those times. We talk about the 70s. You know what I'm saying? 80s. 80s. But we talk about, man, this is early time with the mafia and shit. You know, they dealt with a lot of the gambling on the, on the casinos and shit. You dealing with them motherfuckers. They probably, you probably, come on, man. They only, they really, really probably only probably told bitch to, hey, man, we need you to chill, man. And you was really still full of energy, like, fuck it, I'm going to go play baseball. But when they telling you, we need to chill because somebody probably about to talk some shit about you. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker get paid a lot of money just to say some shit about Michael Jordan on, on, on his backside. So, I mean, I ain't got nothing towards no black man, you know what I'm saying? Um, but the ones who sell us out. <laughs> but this video isn't about sellouts. It's just about the GOAT. LeBron James is the GOAT.